Hello there, this is Ryan from Burly Bricks coming to you live from my obscene Lego room. And today we're talking about this set, Adventures with Su Lego Super Mario Adventures with Luigi. It is 280 pieces and retailed for an insane $75 Canadian. Um, I paid 49, I happened to see it on sale at Walmart and I did the other two, Mario and then Peach. And so I was like, ah, I should get Luigi because I'm a completionist, even though I didn't really want it, but I just had to buy him anyway. So I was glad that I just happened to see him that day grocery shopping for cheap. I thought, why not? I'll try it out. But again, $75 is so expensive. Um, I didn't do a full build of this set on camera because if you've watched my other reviews, which you of course have, um, they don't have the instructions for this. They have the instructions online. So in order to build it like this, you have to download the instructions and then look at your phone or an iPad as they uh, show on the, the instruction. The, it comes with an instruction book, booklet on telling you you have to download instructions, but they show you doing it on a laptop or, um, you know, a big surface but I don't have that I only have my cell phone which is what I'm using to film and I don't want to be like scrolling on my phone and doing this and trying to I just I don't agree with it and actually I know I sound like a broken record but when I looked this setup online I saw it has terrible reviews and some woman wrote in big captions there are no instructions so I was happy that the Dory set that I did a, a, a few weeks ago actually had the instructions with it which was very surprising um, but this one did not and if you're paying $75 like give me some instructions I know it's supposed to be like a whole experience of you like jumping around and doing stuff and blah 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 but you know what no just just give me the instructions um, but yeah so now I have Luigi to match my Mario but again you need to you need a screwdriver and you need batteries and I literally just spent like 15 minutes trying to figure out how to open this guy I found a screwdriver but um, yeah I, I haven't turned him on yet so let's see if he works Lego Luigi time. that sounds weird that's how he looks I mean, Mario sounded like Mario from the games. Peach did not. Um, and Luigi sounds kind bye, of... Bye, Let's turn on again. Lego Luigi time. He sounds kind of like Wario. And actually, when I was building this set, the colors, the purple and the yellow, was making me think a lot of Wario. Um... So I know there's like the Bowser aspect and I know that he's known for having um, like the Luigi's Haunted Mansion games, which I actually haven't played. Uh, so I think that's why this is supposed to look a little spookier. But um, yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about this. There's a lot of, you know, the, the other sets are kind of the same where there's like a bunch of these little segments that you have to build separately and then you attach them with these extra peaches, uh, pieces. But um yeah, let's see. Let's hear some some of his uh, interactions. Here we go. Okay, well, that's always fun to hear. Well, this. Okay. I feel like these are just things. These are just sounds from the game. Um, it comes with Bone Goomba. Pink Yoshi and Boom Boom. Now I just did a pink Yoshi, so I'm a little disappointed I have two. I wish I had a different color, but. Hello there. Okay. Um, and then they have, this was actually a pretty interesting build. Uh, this piece here, I have a lot of them in a, uh, like a sandstone color that I don't know what to do with yet, but I might use them for a different building. I got them in the, the, the 60s Batman um, bat cave but they're like this really big piece that I I, I, I 
I think I might make something or attach it to my hotel. And now I have two other ones, but it looks really nice in this mint green. But there's like this little seesaw. Okay. It's all the same. <laughs> okay. Um, and then let's see what the other guys sound like. So it's kind of like more of the same from the other ones. This time it's just with Luigi. Oh. 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 Okay. So a lot of it sounds the same at this point. And it's very similar to the other ones, to be honest, but it's different in the sense that it has different colors. It's got like yellows, it's got purples, which is actually pretty nice. And um, there's some useful pieces here, don't get me wrong, but these Mario, especially the starter courses, they haven't been my favorite. The Dory one that I did, uh, Dory's Sunken Adventure, I really like that one because I was kind of like, you know what? No, I don't like these, these Mario games. Uh, I'm the Mario starter sets. I don't like that they're so big. I want a little minifigure. And now with the Animal Crossing sets that came out, I'm hoping we'll get like little guys. And I was on the fence about these builds of these figures. Like I kind of wanted actual figures, but you know what? They're kind of growing on me. But again, it's just as awkward having to look up how to build each one of these. And um, I'm uh, again, these are just my thoughts. <laughs> It's not a review, it's just my opinion, but I'm just not really big on these sets. I'm not just mad that I got it because it would bother me literally for the rest of my life if I knew there was a Luigi and I didn't get him. It would have been fine if I hadn't got Peach. I could have just had the Mario, but then once I got Peach, I had to get the Luigi. Um, <laughs> let's see what he sounds like when you turn him off. Bye bye. It's creepy. It's creepy. Um... But yeah, let me know in the comments, did you did you buy this one? I feel like it's not as common. I, I haven't really seen it places um, as much as I've seen the peach ones and things like that. So let me know, did you buy this set? Did you like this set? Are you planning on buying this set? What do you think of these Mario starter sets? I think they're actually retiring them this year. Um, so I, I see them a lot of them on sale. So if you want them, you should probably grab them now. But, uh, but yeah, let me know in the comments what you think about it. Or, or let me know what your favorite Mario game is. Mine is, of course, Mario 64. And with that, have a great rest of your day. Thanks.